Hi everybody, welcome to Simply Scuba. In today's video, I'm gonna be taking a closer look at the Boshat Spy Snorkel. Um, so I've got two colors here, two very neon colors. And um, yeah, these are very simple J-style snorkels. Uh, quite a lot of divers and free divers especially prefer this kind of style. Uh, nothing overly fancy, but it has a few tricks up its sleeve that make it quite practical, mainly in the actual tube itself, not being completely rigid. Um, but yeah, if you're in the market for a, a really decent snorkel with some fairly bright colors at times. Um, let's take a closer look. So this is how they arrive and, uh, and I actually love this minimal packaging. Um, you get all the information that you need. You get a hygiene shield on the uh, on the mouthpiece, but but that's it. No plastic bag, no extra things, because it's a snorkel. You don't always need that much. Um, and yeah, it turned up at my front door with no scuffs so um so yeah i quite like this style of packaging um if i take a look at the um the snorkel itself if i remove this uh, this hygiene shield uh two different colors just so you can see um some of the options of color okay so the snorkel itself traditional um, J style snorkel, nothing overly fancy. This is the style of snorkel that I prefer just because there's very little to go wrong and it just works. The main body of the, uh, the snorkel is semi-rigid, so it does bend, but reluctantly. It feels like there's almost like a, a stiff kind of rib down on the outside, um, but then the rest is a bit more flexible. So it can bend a little bit, but it won't fold completely and sort of shut the airway. But if you're traveling, you throw it in your kit bag or something and it kind of twists, it's not going to snap and break. At the top, you just have a very simple angled opening, uh, no uh, sort of protective outer shell, nothing to get in the way, but because it's angled, it's a little bit of a wave deflector from one side, uh, but otherwise it's just an open, um, an open tube, circular in, uh, in cross section, and it slightly curves around, so that's going to uh, sort of go around your, um, your face. You get a, um, a mask attachment point, so a little loop just a head over your, uh, your mask strap, and that can move up and down as you need it to, so it kind of sits comfortably on the side of your head. And then when you get down to the lower section, then it gets to a much softer material, softer silicone. You've got a reinforced section, so it does hold its shape, but it is all a lot more softer, and, uh, and that's where the mouthpiece is, pretty traditional mouthpiece integrated uh, sort of lower U-bends, which does have a bit of that uh, sort of water trap. So if a small amount of water does make its way inside of the snorkel, it's gonna trap it down at the bottom. So if you breathe gently, you should be able to breathe past it. But a good exhale should be able to uh, sort of clear it out. And um, and otherwise, yeah, a good, a good all arounder. As I said at the beginning, I, I prefer this style of snorkel because it's quite practical. You can use it for in-water rescue breaths, um, but it is very, tough, reliable, does what you need it to, uh, to do and, uh, and doesn't have, have any uh, sort of extra bits that can go wrong. And that's the Boshat Spy Snorkel. Traditional snorkel, nothing overly fancy, but when you're looking for a uh, this sort of basic style of J snorkel, this is kind of the design that I'd, uh, I'd usually recommend because it's got that semi-rigid um, uh, tube to it. So that's going to help with uh, sort of longevity. And yeah, you can match your style with all sorts of different colors. There's gonna be more information on our website though, simplyscuba.com. There's gonna be a link down in the description below so you can check out all of the different colors of the Spy Snorkel. Uh, just click on that link and head over to simplyscuba.com. Thank you for watching everybody and of course, safe diving. Thank you.